Okay, Cranky Grandma here with my stitch fix. I, some of you know that watch before, I have been sick for a little bit. I am better now. Um, cleared to open my stitch fix box without danger of contagion. Um, so my son suggested I open it a little differently. All right, knock my picture off the wall. I don't think this is gonna work. This, by the way, is Andoral. This is Aragorn sword. Um, a sword that was broken and may soon be broken again. That actually worked. That was pretty cool. All right. Yay. Now, let's see what's in the Stitch Fix box. If you're wondering what the heck Stitch Fix is, I will have a description below in the description bar as well as a referral link if you want to check it out. Okay. And here is my invoice and note from the stylist along with my styling cards a prepaid bag to return anything I do not want and now let me see what's in the bag this month um, I did peek you can peek ahead once your order ships if you have an iPad or iPhone I did look I was very excited by the order I hope this stuff fits this indicates shoes I got shoes for the first time a shoe bag I asked for slip-on shoes Ooh, and these are on the thing they look bright yellow but they're sort of a a tan like a uh, it's got a little bit of gold in it now what I get a kick out of is I don't know how well you can see that on camera we've been fussing with the lighting in here I'm driving my son crazy he's got the camera it's the best lighting we're gonna get that looks a little like a band-aid doesn't it it's got little holes in it actually I think it's cool it just always struck me whenever I see this they look like band-aids um, but I'm okay with that these are CVs there's a pair of what size are they uh, Seven and a half. Are they wide? I put, ooh, they're not wide. I need wide shoes, so I have a feeling I have an aroma in my one foot. I need wide shoes. I had that listed on Stitch Fix that I need seven and a half wide. These might be wide enough on themselves. I will check them out during the try-on. I hope they fit. Now, here is my little bundle. Let me put the box down. And everything's wrapped in the bundle. It's a little thick. Ooh, that looks so nice. Can you see what's in there? I asked for folly things. Cameraman's nodding. You can see what's in there. Okay. Let's open this up. All right. And see what we got. Oh, wow. Now, some of you might remember I got a burgundy dress that didn't quite fit and I mourned it last time. Here is a burgundy cardigan. I don't know how well you can see that from there. I can't see the uh, the camera. So you know what, we're just gonna try it on in a few minutes, you'll get to see it then. Okay, this is, and this is a large, I'm kinda between sizes right now, so I'm really hoping these fit. I love this. Uh, I always have a little bit of concern when there's buttons down the front, because sometimes I get gaping, but we'll see. I love the colors on this, it's very, um, kind of a muted, I don't know if you can tell where you are, I'm saying this is kind of a muted, orange it looked yellow and orange and red in the picture but it's really um it's not quite that color as i see it in person i like this a lot in the back there's a little you can see a little bit of the detailing in the back all right so we'll try that on in a minute and this huh this looks very different than i expected this is first of all a lot greener in person than it looked on the preview if you look at previews, I see people look at their Stitch Fix previews and say, oh, I don't like anything. But you have to see the things in person because they often look very different than the pictures. This has, okay, that's the, that's the back. Can you see the detailing in the back? A little bit of a pleat. Free flowy on the bottom. Green, my favorite color. And a plain front. This does not feel like cotton. Mark it and spruce. Let me see what this is made of. As usual, the names and descriptions of everything will be in the bottom. I am still, it is 100% linen. Hand wash, lay fat to dry. Do I want a linen shirt? It looks nice. We'll try it on. We will see. Again, I'm not 100% yet after being out sick for a while. Um, not contagious anymore, but I'm still a little bit run down. So, um, and these concerned me a little. I checked off on my box. I did not want skinnies. And I don't think the message got through because I'm not sure I can get away with skinny jeans. But we are going to try these. These look awfully small for me. No, that's actually my size. 
and they are a nice deep green so we will do a try on now and see how everything looks okay i'm going to, i forgot to read my note from my stylist you get a note from your stylist in your box as most of you know let me read it hi monica i hope you're having a fantastic start to fall you have to love it when the weather starts to cool down and the trees start to turn now mitch the stylist is in texas so i don't think these trees are turning yet but ours are just starting to outside uh, the leaves are starting to go down on the ground. Let me see. I focused on colors that really speak to the season in this box, starting you off with a pair of forest green skinny jeans by Lila Ryan that are perfect for both casual days and the classroom as well. A great upside to colored jeans is how easily they can be dressed up. Pair them with the Liffy orange and navy plaid button down, or go with a brighter green tulle and top and the burgundy Martina cardigan. You mentioned being interested in some cushy flats, so I grabbed you the Baja CVs, Varsity sneakers, and a deep mustard shade. A super comfy and equally cute style. Have an awesome time trying these on. Love, Mitch. Now, Mitch did a fantastic job, as usual, picking colors and things that go together. Unfortunately, because I work for a service and I'm in a different school each day, they have a fairly strict dress code, and jeans are frowned on. Some schools I could get away with, even colored jeans. Skinny jeans, I thought, no way in a million years, they will never fit on an old lady like me. They fit really well, I think. So, I don't know. I'm leaning on this like a cane on this sword with my bad foot. How does the outfit look with a sword? It's sort of um, Numenorean hipster? I don't know. Anyway, how do these jeans look? You tell me in the comments. I am really amazed. I can tuck these into boots in the fall. They're really comfortable. They're a little bit lower rise or like a mid rise and I like high rise because it sucks my belly in. But they're really comfortable and I like them. I love the top. I'm going to have to see, look on camera and see how the colors look. Um, I dyed my hair yesterday. It'll be in about a week, about a shade lighter than this. It usually is really darker when I dye it. We'll see how the hair and the rest of me look with this color. This, I would say, is about a size too small. As I said, I'm between sizes. It depends on the item. So I may exchange this for a size higher. Now, these are really tight in the arms. That's where it's hitting me, in the lower arms. There's not a lot of movement. I love the pattern, and I think if I size up, it might be a little too big. But I like it enough. It's very soft and comfortable. Real pockets. Um... I might try sizing up and see how it works because I like this loads and I like the colors. This is the, and again, I'll have the names and prices in the description below because I keep forgetting to say what these items are. This is the Pixley Martina Slub Knit Open Cardigan and I love it and I'm keeping it. I posted on the Facebook Stitch Fix group that this was coming and I had about five people offer to buy it from me and I said no I haven't even opened my box yet no well nobody's getting this from me this is fantastic um, I there's nothing in this box so far I don't like other than the one thing is uh, definitely the wrong size for me I need to size up on that plaid uh, put this down you'll see this top Okay, it is nice and loose. The one thing I'm a little iffy on, just come a little high up here, but the advantage to being as short as me is on a tall person, this would show some skin. You might have to wear a cardi. On me, I don't know if I raise my hands up, will it? I'd have to walk around like I was being arrested for that to be a big problem. Okay, that's, this is really comfortable. Linen. Do I really want to wash linen? I might. This is awesome. I definitely can wear this to work with something else. The jeans, probably not. Now the shoes, I think I mentioned earlier, I have an aroma in my foot, which makes it really difficult for me to get shoes. This foot is wider than the other one because of an aroma, which is a damaged, swollen nerve. It's more than you wanted to know. You can Google it. Um, I need a really wide toe box. And normally I have to get wide size shoes, but these actually are wide enough. I'm going to like walk around in the house for about a half an hour and see how my foot holds up. But these are comfortable. And these are really too casual for work normally, but I do let the schools know when I come that because of an injury I need sneakers or something like them to walk around. And I think these would be fine. 
Okay, can you see the shoe? I said before they look like a band-aid, and when I looked at the cut, I realized you can't tell that. They have little dots in them, little holes, like a strip on a band-aid. They do not, however, sting when you pull them off. Um, and it is sort of a deep, dark mustard, uh, like a spicy brown mustard color. I love these, and I really hope they give a lot of support in the shoe, too. So I'm really, really, really happy with these. Okay, I am... Um... <sighs> Boy... I'm really happy with this fix. I'm also unhappy because I really don't want to buy everything in the box, but I might anyway. Um, one thing with Stitch Fix is if you do buy all five items, you get a 25% discount on everything. So if you like, even if you like four out of five, sometimes it's better just to get the five and then somebody on the Facebook group will nab up the one that, you know, that's left over. But I'm amazed. I even like, these are the first pair of skinny jeans I have ever liked. Uh, everything, the colors go well together. This is really one outfit with an extra top that I can kind of interchange. I could get a tremendous amount of use out of this. Uh, I am just, my first two fixes were really iffy, and then I got Mitch as a stylist, and I have been really thrilled ever since. If you are going to get Stitch Fix and just try, don't get Mitch for a stylist because I want him. I don't want to, I don't want to lose him for a stylist, all right? I think he's getting to be in real big demand because he is really, really good. And there's some other stylists that are really, really good, too. And I'm teasing. If you want to request much, you can. Um, anyway, the items I got are the CV's Baja Slip-On Varsity Sneakers, the Pixley Martina Slub Knit Open Cardigan that I love. Put little hearts in my eyes, Thomas. Can you do that with special effects? He's shaking his head no. Probably just as well. The Lila Ryan... Liza colored skinny jean and this is actually a little bit on the pricey side. It's pricier than I, I realized it was. They fit really really nicely though. Uh, skies are blue liffy button down top that I will have to exchange for an extra large. If they do not have an extra large that may change what I keep out of the box. And the market and spruce tulin pleated back knit top which I believe is this one I'm wearing. I didn't think I would like it the linen top but I absolutely love it. Uh, also in the box, I forgot to mention before, because I'm not quite functioning on all thrusters today, they send you little styling cards that give you an idea of what you could wear. For example, that button-down top. I don't know if you can see the card from here. They're suggesting pairing it. Those look like boyfriend jeans that are cuffed. There's little booties. I love booties. My Neroma doesn't love booties, but I love booties. And there's one of those, uh, what do you call those? green jackets, anorak, I think. Okay, so that gives you an idea. And then if you wanted to dress it up a little bit, they have skinny jeans, some regular flats, and sort of a dressier cardigan. And they do that with each. This one with a skirt. Actually, I have a skirt very much like that. Could wear in the classroom, no trouble at all. And then if you just want to go out in shorts, which we don't have too many days left this year that I would be wearing shorts, I would wear that. Same thing, they give you styling ideas with the different items. So if you're not sure what to do, with the clothing, they give you ideas, go through your closet and find things you can use. Stitch Fix, I will now give you the spiel. If you don't know about Stitch Fix, it is a styling service. You pay $20 for a stylist to style you. You give them your sizes, you fill out a detailed profile, what you like and what you don't like. The computer algorithm picks out some suggested items and the stylist works with that. They can veto it if they want, give you something else, and they put together a box of five items for you. They ship it to you. You keep what you want. You mail back what you don't. If you buy anything, that $20 styling fee comes off, so you end up with no styling fee if you purchase anything. If you purchase nothing, you're still at the $20 styling fee. So if you want to try it, click the referral link in the bottom um, and uh, give it a go. And uh, I will see you next time with my next box, whatever I get next. Bye-bye.